Hi everyone, this is an Amalgia video for Animal Crossing New Horizons on the Nintendo Switch, and today we're going to be talking about an easy way to get a, over 150,000 HHA points. HHA rankings have a lot of calculations that go into them, and a lot of penalties as well. This video isn't about how everything is calculated within a room. I'm just going to focus on some simple tricks that you can use in order to boost your HHA ranking. Although, I will be referencing some bonus mechanics here and there. While it's possible to still get S rank with a score below 150,000, you won't be able to get the gold HHA trophy until you surpass 150,000 points. Anyway, let's get to some strategies. Firstly, remember April's Easter event and all the eggs your town was overwhelmed with? Well, it turns out that the extra eggs were more useful than we originally thought they were. If a full set of Bunny Day furniture is placed within the same room of your home, it gives a tremendous HHA points bonus. But here's where stockpiling extra eggs comes in handy. You can keep putting full sets of Bunny Day furniture in all the above ground rooms of your home and it'll keep raising your HHA points bonus. While the subsequent Bunny Day rooms aren't going to be as valuable as the first one you place in your home, having an entire furniture set together collected in the same room still gives a massive points bonus. The other thing that's very valuable about the Bunny Day set is that it has a lot of items in it. So not only do you collect the points from having a complete set bonus, but I think you get points based on the number of furnishings that are in that set. So any sets that have a high amount of furnishings will net more points. When I got over 170,000 HHA points, my west room, my north room, and my second floor all had full sets of Bunny Day furniture in them. And that netted me enough points where I didn't even have to worry about my main room. And then in the east room, which I will show you in a minute, I used a trick where you have over 90% of all furniture in a single room be the exact same color. So if you don't have any leftover eggs and you can't make another set of Bunny Day furniture, I suggest doing something like this. Go through your Nook catalog on your Nook shopping app and pick out the color that you have the most furniture items for. It also helps to have all the basic necessities like a bed, a table, a chair, and a wardrobe. But if you're missing one of those, I wouldn't worry too much about it. This room had no bed and it had no table and I still got a large number of HHA points for having so many red items in the same room. Keep in mind that for the color bonus, the wallpaper and floor do not need to match the color-themed items in the room in order to get the bonus. Another thing that helps is that if you have any of the other HHA items, the plaques, the other trophies that you can put in your room, make sure you do so because they're also worth a large amount of HHA points. Another thing that can help but won't be the main way you get HHA points is by adhering to the principles of feng shui. Uh, if you haven't seen my video on feng shui, I'll provide a link to it, but uh, you should check that out. And if you can use feng shui bonuses without ruining your color bonus in the room, then by all means do so. Anyway, this is the best way that I've found to just instantly smash all the HHA tiers without even having to try. So I hope this video helps, and thanks for watching. 